I'm David Bloomberg, and this is a mini Y Blank One for Australian Survivor Heroes vs. Villains. Winner of Australian Survivor Heroes vs. Villains, Liz. Congratulations to Liz for winning. She definitely made the best arguments in Final Tribal Council and cemented herself as the most active of the remaining three players. Liz made an alliance with Shoni and George at the very beginning and took it all the way to the end. Now, by no means did she play a perfect game, as she and Shawnee fought the wrong battle to keep Flick, just so Flick could turn around on them, and also made the mistake of showing that she and Shawnee were a tight duo. But whatever happened, Liz stuck with or went back to George. And that's really the key. The final three all rode George's coattails to the end in one way or another. Yes, Liz and Matt had immunity wins, but all of them were hiding behind George. And they all made, obviously, the right decision to cut him before the end. Note that I said they all made that decision. Liz took credit for it, but she was just one vote and not aligned with the other two. But she was forceful and wouldn't back down, which also marked other aspects of her game at times. And with this final three, that was important. Simon said a couple episodes ago that to him, it's better to try and fail than it is to not try at all. And that really was at the heart of what Liz said in some of her own final words. Claiming a move that ended up being wrong isn't usually the greatest idea. But when Matt couldn't even put together a sentence to explain a move that he had made, it showed decisiveness on Liz's part. Matt and Jerry were viewed by many as just riding George's coattails. And although they tried, they did nothing to change that viewpoint. Liz, by having that best tribal council, asserted that she had done more and convinced literally everyone on the jury. Was Liz the best overall player of Australian Survivor Heroes vs. Villains? No, obviously not. But I often say the best player in one aspect doesn't necessarily win because people can see that they're threats and vote them out. You need to be the best player by the final three uh, by taking into account all of my rules. Liz worked with the best of the season and was the best of those remaining after they all voted out George. And that is why Liz won.